Okay. Hi. We uh, <laughs> that high made me forget what I was even gonna fucking say. Sorry. Wait. Look, okay. Cut. Sony, if you're watching this, anybody who's watching this, I'm telling y'all, I've already made a video about this. I'm not shilling that video. I'm just saying Days Gone is a masterpiece. I would have used the F word to describe it, but she's got me convinced that I can't cuss on the 30 seconds <laughs> of the video. But just wait till that 30 seconds is over. I don't know if it's 30 seconds, but... Days Gone is a masterpiece. And I know what you're thinking. I don't know what you're thinking, but I know what some of you are thinking. Wait, you mean that stupid game that has those awful reviews? And I would have thought the same thing. I, you is know, it only awful reviews? The old, the, the reviews that first came out of it were atrocious. Atrocious. Mm -hmm. 6.5. Nobody waits five years to play a game that's 6.5. 6.5, 6, 6.5, 5, 5.5, 6, 6, 6, 5, 5, 5. you know, just the last thing you want to hear. And I heard those reviews. I know I'm repeating my other video like a parrot, but I said, I'm not playing this, even though I've waited five years to play it. So I waited months and months, didn't play it. Then I went to my library. I'm going to say this real quick so I don't repeat everything I say, even though I already repeat what I say. I went to my library and I noticed I could rent it. So I got on the queue for it, waited a few months, and when I got yeah. it, um, I, I, um, I, I, I had it until almost it was due to go back. And I'm like, eh, I'll play it. I played it, played it, played it, played it, and I could not fucking believe how good that game is. Please. And it's set in Oregon, which is awesome. Yes, but <laughs> it could be set in Timbuk fucking too. I don't care. And I played it thinking it was going to not be fun. It was so fun. I I, I did the whole game. Please, Sony. Play please game. make Days Gone 2. I'm telling you, because I've been spreading the word about this game. Pretty much reviews about games, they're not infallible, but it's not like with movies. If everybody says a movie sucks, there's a good chance it sucks. I know that's not always true, especially I love the movie Roadhouse. I think that's a masterpiece. I don't care what anybody says. It's a great, a great movie about the law of attraction. Uh, Point Break's a, an amazing movie. Um, Young Guns, that's one of my favorite movies ever. Sandlot, and Sandlot used to have a shitty review on Rotten Tomatoes. Those are great movies that have shitty reviews. Sandlot, so, uh, It's not so always amazing. infallible. Listen to me. I know a lot about video games, okay? I don't know everything, but I made a list. I didn't tell her about this. It's probably going to annoy her, so I'm just going to say it real quick. This is just so you know that I know what good video games are. These are all video games that I own. Red Dead 2, I think that's the best game ever made. It's not my favorite, but I think technically Red Dead Redemption 2 is the best game ever made. It's in my top three. Red Dead Redemption 2, these are all games I love that I own. Bloodborne, Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3, Dark Souls 2. I actually, I, I thought it would suck, but I played it. I actually enjoyed it. It, do not, if you post that on the Dark Souls 2 subreddit, I know it annoys the fuck out of them. Just every other post, hey guys, I heard Dark Souls 2 sucked, it's actually good. Demon Souls Remake, loved it, Breath of the Wild, Masterpiece Symphony of the Night, God of War 4, Neo 2, Persona 5, Mario Odyssey, Cyberpunk PS5, Dishonored 2, Streets of Rage 4, Mortal Kombat, Wolfenstein 2, Uncharted 4, Shovel Knight, I'm almost done, I know this is annoying. Mario 3D World, GTA 5, Witcher, Cathedral, Hades, love it, I love all these. Wow. Dead Cells, Bro Force, Call of War is Gunslinger, that's an amazing fucking game, trust me on this. Ugh. Owlboy, Katana Zero, Katana, uh, Katamari, Monster Boy, and the Curse Kingdom, Iconoclast, class Message, I know this is annoying, Messenger, The Messenger, that game was fucking hard, but I still liked it, Bloodstained, Ritual of the Night, Hollow Knight, Blasphemous, Risk of Rain 2, Ghost of Tsushima, Spel Spelunky 2, Neo 1, Limbo, Inside, Dying Light, so the first last those of are us all games that I own and love, yes, The Last of Us, the and what about first Cuphead? Last of Us. I'm not getting into Cuphead. No, I have no response on Cuphead. Cuphead's a beautiful game. No comment, it's nothing so to say, because I don't want to, you know. I, I read a lot of Law of Attraction so, books. So, we're making this video because so, in but, the news, do you want to tell them? Let me just say this. I listed all those games so you know that I know what I'm talking about, that I know what good games are. I already fucking said that, didn't I? Yeah, in the news it said supposedly, go ahead. So, in the news it's it's uh, trending on Twitter and it said that in 2019, Ben Studios tried to pitch, uh, uh, what's it called? This is what I deal My with every day. It's one of her favorite games um, of all time, and she doesn't remember gone. what it's called. Okay, they tried to pitch Days Gone 2, and uh, they were denied. That was in 2019. Allegedly. Because so this were, isn't fact. It's alleged, okay? So they were assigned to do, like, stuff for for Naughty Dog and stuff like that. So, so yeah, we don't know if they're ever going to do a Days Gone 2, but we really, really hope they do. I, I mean, And they're talking about like remaking The Last of Us. Remaking. Like, I don't even think they're saying remastering. Remaking The Last so of Us. So I have no comment on that either, because I want to be completely positive. I'm reading a lot of attraction books, and you got to talk about what you want, not what you don't want. I almost named this, this video, Don't Cancel Days Gone 2, but that's negative. So what I want to say, hopefully I make this the title, please make Days Gone 2. That game is Sony, so amazing. please make Days Gone 2. We love it so much. I've actually beat it twice. And my brother, I beat it twice. Yeah. yeah, my brother won't play it. Yeah. 
because he, he read the reviews. He just won't play it. He'll play Last of Us and Last of Us 2. He loves zombie stuff. I know technically those aren't zombies, and I know technically they're not zombies in Days Gone, but come on. I'm gonna the story's so good, the setting. I've even told the writer of Days Gone how much I loved yeah. it, and he tweeted and me he back. he watched your other video. I'm not going to put his DMs right? on here because that's weird. But Did he, he watch your other video? Yeah, he watched my review, and he said thanks, and I was like, no problem, man. Days Gone the is... The video where you have, like, a big crotch. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> So, remember that big list of games that I just did? That was to let you, the viewer, know that I do know what some good games are. I know that sounds pretentious. You might hate some of those games. But, I mean, I, I'm a fucking gamer. I love games. I play tons of games. Days Gone, somehow I like it better than all of them. I care so much about Deacon St. John in the game. I care so much about the story. The gameplay is phenomenal. The slow down focus mechanic. Yeah, so riding, riding. Riding your fucking motorcycle. The There's no weak link. And I, I think, I already said this in the other video... God, Greg, how many times are you going to say, I already said this in the other video, that I think that they didn't have all the patches out, and that's why it got mm -hmm. shit on, but just play Days Gone now. Do me a favor, play Days Gone. And it's free on PlayStation Plus. And don't Plus. just play it for an hour or something, like, play it. it. Beat it. Yeah. And you tell me that that's a <laughs> shitty game. It's so fucking good, man. So fun. I don't... How could they have made it better? And, uh, you know, I... I go play it again and tell the truth. The three best characters... Four... Okay, the four best well-acted characters in the history of video games, it, it's all come out recently. It's God of War 4... Kratos, it's Arthur Morgan. Kratos, the actor, would have won that year, but Arthur Morgan killed it. Then you have Nathan Drake, and then oh, you have uh, he's so good. Deacon St. John. And I used to think Drake and Arthur Morgan were my favorite. I, and I, I can't even believe I'm saying this. My favorite video game character is Deacon St. John. That's the main character protagonist in uh, Sam Witwer in uh, Days Gone 2. See, and even he I looks almost just like out. our friend. Feels like a real fucking person. Yes, he looks just like my friend John T. And if <laughs> Should I, we show him again? <laughs> yeah, let's again. show him again. <laughs> I could make a whole video about John T. Love you, John T. I know you're watching this, and I hope everything goes well, and I hope that you have a great day today, and I'm being dead fucking serious, because when I was homeless, you let me live in your house. This guy let me live on his fucking floor for a month when I was homeless, so I don't forget. Love you, John. But Sony, um, I, I mean that legitimately. I love this guy. Sony, please, make Days Gone 2. What I was telling her, she was reading in the news that they're not making it, but what I had to explain to her, not that I know no. everything, is there's no actual proof they're not making it. For all we know, can I just say something? As if I haven't talked enough. Ooh, that, that's, I, I gotta edit that out. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm Imagine. kidding. Uh, fuck, what is, I was gonna say something. Oh, just because it says in the news they're not making it doesn't mean they're making it. Because what is the chances we're getting this news about Days Gone 2 just a four, three, four days after they make Days Gone free for PlayStation Plus? So this is what I'm telling her. Sony might be making Days no, Gone 2. Can out. I say this? <laughs> Sony might be making Days Gone 2, but they're like, hmm, we don't know if we should continue making it. So let's see if, if anybody cares. Let's see if there's an outcry for people to make Days Gone 2. It's possible. So that's why I'm putting up this video. Hopefully there's an outcry and people want to play it. Now I'm going to go fuck myself, suck myself, shut the fuck up and let it talk. But it, it's trendy because it's it was like a Bloomberg article. So Nana, just because it's in the news doesn't mean it's real. No, but in 2019 they denied it. I don't think this is were some you there? Were, were you in the room when they told John Garvin, hey man, fuck yeah. you, we're not making that game, suck my dick. No, he you weren't. He called me right after. I mean, we're Oregonian, so, you know. He, I'm just saying, I don't want to believe back. it. His... There's a denial thing, but just because it's in the news doesn't, wasn't DMX, didn't somebody say that he passed before he passed the other day? Yeah. Sadly, he passed now, what I heard, but I'm just saying, just because the news, that means it's fucking true. Should I cut out that DMX part? Okay. Rip DMX. Just because you hear it in the news... Does it make it true, Greg? You repeat yourself all the fucking time. But uh, I do talk like it, this actually. There's like just a track record of them wanting to just do blockbusters, like them wanting to remake a Last of Us because they know. Oh, I read too. There's going to be a multi. They're working on a multiplayer Last of Us to keep making money, you know, online. Just please, just, I mean, do whatever you want, but can't you make Days Gone 2 as well? Like, the reviews, there's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna double down on this statement. There has never in the history, history of video games, been any game that was reviewed wronger than Days Gone. Nothing wronger. ever it, wronger. And <laughs> also, never. just, could, Nana, wrong, people make up new words all the time. Like, I don't say best, I say bestest. And guess what? Eventually, bestest is going to be a word. And even if it's not, who's the who's the word police? Do you know yeah. ain't? I'm pretty sure ain't used to not be a word, but so many people use it. It's actually in a dictionary now. My mom actually said, Greg, don't say ain't. I'm like, oh, mom, you know ain't's in the dictionary. And she's like, no, it's not. I'm like, yeah, it is. I've already said this in another video. Did you look it up? And yes, ain't like, is in the dictionary. Got him. Um, but please, I'm... I'm not begging you, you know, but Please. just play Sony? play Days Gone. Sony, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Please, it's Sony. Uh, it, it's it's as good. Great, that, get the thumbnail. That game, ugh. 
<laughs> that game, like whenever, I love Nikocado Avocado videos, but once you've seen a lot of them, it, it's so hilarious when you see him doing the thumbnail for 10 minutes in the video. Is like, I love you, Nick. Him. I watch all your videos. Not all of them. That's, I watch some of them. I saw the six hour right opinion doc about you and that actually made me want to watch your videos. Very interesting guy. Uh, I don't talk this much usually, but I have a lot to get out and I don't want to annoy the fuck out of her, but it's too late. I already annoy her. She's annoyed by everything I do. So I'm trying to work on not being annoying. Oh, and, and, the, and just so we're being honest, I don't have uh, red eyebrows. I have to dye my eyebrows with just for men gel, because if not, it looks like I have a foot long forehead. I've said this in another video. Okay, I'm gonna stop saying that. So I dyed my eyebrows today. I never wear shit like this. I like this shirt, but I usually just wear a t-shirt and the same fucking jacket every day, but I wanted to look cool and presentable on the camera. So all this is just made up for the camera. So Sony, if you're watching this, please make days comment gone. down below if you like his eyebrows and please make days gone too. Thank you. One more thing too. <laughs> we had a, a pretty substantial argument, not any sort of physical or name calling altercation, but uh, she said, how does my hair look? And I've already told her five times today that her hair looked great, but here's the problem with this. She irons her hair and she thinks it only looks good if she irons it. Well, the, it usually looks like... And, and you know, she she's multi-ethnic. I think she's beautiful. You're, you're a mix, you're an eclectic mix of different eclectic ethnicities mix. and here, there's, there's a catch-22 by saying her hair looks nice after she irons it. When she irons all the ethnicity out of her hair and I say it looks nice, what am I saying? I'm saying, oh, you only look nice because you whitified your hair. No, you look nice with your hair curly. You look nice with your hair straight. You don't have to do jack shit to but your fucking hair and you look nice. sometimes I just nice. want to know if my hair looks okay. Yeah, but I'm not going to go magically, oh, your hair looks amazing after you iron the blackness out of it. That's fucking weird. <laughs> you look beautiful with with uh, curly hair, non-curly hair. I mean, but I'm not going to specifically say your hair looks good when you iron the blackness well, out of it. Well, it just helps it. me tame it, so... Why do you have to fucking tame it? Who I mean, cares? If you saw my hair. Like, yeah, I see your fucking hair every day. It no, looks nice. It was in a bun. No, you look nice tied. with curly hair. If you want to straighten your hair, that's fine. I'm not telling you not to, but you don't only look fucking pretty when you straighten your hair. We had a Anyways. big argument about this. So, anything else you want to say to Sony? <laughs> Sony. <laughs> Sony. Dude. I'm, I'm, seriously, dude. And I know there's a dude working at Sony, and I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Days Gone is a fucking masterpiece. And you probably haven't played it. You've just read those stupid ass reviews. Oh, I gotta be you positive. Gotta those blessed it. reviews. She helped me this come up. This should be the video title. You gotta play it. Yep. And I'm coining this term right now. She came up with it. She mixed two terms I say together. I wish them the best. I wish apostrophe E M. I wish them, no, excuse me. I wish them the blessed. So I'm gonna be the first person to use that term. I'm coining it right now. Because his last name's Blessing. I wish Sony the blessed. But guys, play fucking Days Gone too. It is a master. I mean, not Days Gone too. Played Freudian slip. Played. That's not a Freudian slip. What the fuck am I saying? Play Days Gone. And your brother played it for like an hour, right? He didn't play shit. So, okay. Play he didn't play anything. An that motherfucker did not play. Andrew. Just play it for a whole day. Well, play it for hours and Andrew hours. Doesn't Andrew doesn't watch anything I do. Hooked. I don't watch anything he does. It's just, <laughs> it's not like personal, but on the off fucking chance that Andrew's phone slips, falls out of his pocket, hits the ground, starts playing my video, and somebody comes in with those Kubrick Clockwork Orange Eye things, and they force him at gunpoint to watch this video right now, and Andrew's watching, <laughs> he can't get out of it. He's trying to look away. Andrew, play Days Gone. I'm telling you, dude, it is a fucking masterpiece. I emailed the writer and told him, and he was like, thanks, bro, and I'm not going to put his DMs here. That's fucking weird. I'm sitting, I'm sitting in a park. I know people can hear me walking by, and they're like, what the fuck is this guy doing? By the time people are done with your videos, they're like, man, a lot of days have gone. Guys, them, they, girl, please play fucking Days Gone. What do I have to do? Do you want me to do you want me to list this? You don't want me to list all these games I played. I know what a good fucking game is. Anybody that says Red Dead 2 sucks, I have to question the reality they live in. That if game is Red a Dead fucking sucks, masterpiece. You can suck smile. And like Breath of the Wild, there's certain games, Symphony of the Night, Castlevania Symphony of the Night, there's just certain games, God of War 4, it's it's God of War, that you know are amazing. They're everything about them is amazing. And Days Gone deserves to be in that category. Days Gone is one of the best fucking games ever to exist on this planet. Don't I mean, believe me, go play it. And even I beat it twice. But I did have you, you help me. You beat it twice? Yeah, I did have Sorry, you help my brain's me. Weird. Go ahead. I did have you help me with um, some of the zombie hordes, remember? I think they, they tied that down. It's funny, the training mission. The, oh yeah, the training I know it's, mission's hard. There's That's a training mission on cat. You don't kill hordes till later in the game, but the training mission is harder than a fuckity fuck. I think they toned it down. It, that was harder than any horde killing in the game, which I well, thought was Well, it's funny. like once you get past that part, then you can you can do any of the, the hordes. Because, you know. 
know? John John mm -hmm. Garvin. Uh, we've we've spoken online before. If you're watching this, dude, what you did is just phenomenal. You, what you wrote was just fucking amazing. I care about everybody. And the director, I need to look up the director's name. I don't know. I only interacted with the writer, John Garvin. Dude, you know what you created is amazing. I know people mm -hmm. tell you this every day. And and I, I know that I'm a weirdo. I know that I, you know, I'm bipolar and stuff. But you can be a weirdo and bipolar and know what a fucking good video game is, okay? I'm not walking around seeing, like, hallucinogenic stars and alternate realities. I know what a good game is. We're being looked at right now. I don't give a fuck. And you made a masterpiece. From the guy who dyed his eyebrows for this video, because if he didn't, he has see-through eyebrows. Will you eyebrows. show people the view from where we're sitting? It actually looks like Days Gone. Dude. They, them, chick. Beautiful. I can't say chick anymore. Who the fuck said I... Why can't I say chick? Chick's just the, the chick version of dude. Okay, are we done filming? Sure. Thanks for listening, and please play Days Gone. I don't know why I'm doing this. I love Zooms. She hates Zooms. I love Zooms. Go fuck myself. So I thought the video was over. We're still on the hair topic. <laughs> I, I have to say this again. Think of the weird position I'm in. She only asked me when her hair, if her hair looks good when she straightens it. You're, how many ethnicities are you? I don't even fucking remember. You're Native American. You're black. You're, you're Irish. Irish. And what, German. German, right? No, so no, no. Irish and British. How do you not fucking remember? <laughs> but you're an eclectic mix. And anytime you straighten your hair, you go, oh, Greg, or Blessing. I'm going to call myself Blessing now. I like being called Blessing. You can call me whatever the fuck you want, Craig. I don't care. But Blessing is what they call me in the military. Anyway, you're like, uh, Greg, doesn't my hair look nice? Blessing. You don't say, what the fuck am I even saying right now? And, and what am I <laughs> supposed to do? Oh, yes, Savannah. Just because you made your hair look like another white person, it looks great. No, I'm not going to say it looks great. It, it's, it does, allegedly. But I'm not gonna like. That's weird. <laughs> why do you like? Why would I only say your hair looks great when you make no, it? No, I just want to say when you it when you good. literally ironed it. You know what's hilarious? We were watching this show. I don't remember what it was, but you were dissing this chick for uh, getting rid of her ethnicity. And guess what she was doing as she was watching the show? She was ironing the ethnicity out of her hair. <laughs> as I was watching, I was it's like the hair. definition of a fucking hypocrite. <laughs> oh, why isn't she embracing her ethnicity? And I turn around and you're like just ironing the fucking shit out of your hair. I must look like a generic white person. I must look like a generic no, white person. No, I don't. I like, just want my hair to be. You pink. look good with 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 hair sticking up. You look good with your hair curled. You don't need. I mean, if you want to have straight hair, that's fine. But you ain't gonna get me to fucking shill that shit. Okay. <laughs> okay. I, think I don't know what the fuck is going on with me right now, man. I think it's the Days Gone 2 residual effect. Just yeah. make, fucking make Days Gone 2, please. Just do it for me, right? Fuck it, just do it for me. I can't, you know what? In the Law of Attraction books, it says you have to act as if you already believed it. I've read so many Law of Attraction books, so let me break it down for you in one sentence. Even in the Bible, it says this. Believe that you have it, and you will have it. You have to feel the feelings of having it. So right now, I feel the feelings of being a multimillionaire. I feel the feelings of having enough money to pay somebody to make Days Gone 2 just for me. Just do it for me, okay? Normally this is the part of the video where I berate myself, talk shit to myself, talk about being annoying and tell myself to go fuck myself, but now I'm gonna say go bless myself. Wish them the blessed, right? Yeah. I wish them the blessed. <laughs>